how to request by email for the complete combustion of cyclopropane. Combustion is when a hydrocarbon burns in air to make carbon dioxide and water. As long as no carbon monoxide or soot is made, it is complete combustion. Let's start by figuring out what cyclopropane is. It is three C's in a ring, and then you have enough hydrogens to complete the octet on each of the carbons. So there's your molecular structure of cyclopropane. What matters to you is that it is C3H6. Great start. Now, combustion is combining with gas phase oxygen. Complete combustion is when that reaction results in only carbon dioxide and water being produced. If any other byproducts are made, it's not complete combustion. Your job now is to simply balance this. Three carbons on this side, I need three carbons on this side. Great. Six, car six hydrogens on this side, I need six hydrogens on this side but they come in packs of two. So I only need three of those packs. Three times two is six. Now I just need to balance my oxygens. There's six of them here. See, there's two oxygens in each CO2. Three times two is six, plus three more. That's nine oxygens on this side. Hmm, they come in packs of two. One option for you is to write nine halves here, or 4.5. You need 4.5 of these molecules to have 9 oxygens total. But if you don't need the fractions, like if, it, if you don't have to fix this coefficient to be 1 like you would for enthalpy of combustion, your other option is to simply double all of these numbers. You could say that you have two cyclopropanes. Double that requires 9 oxygens. That would produce six carbon dioxides. See, two times three is six. Six C's here as well. And double that to six H2Os. Two cyclopropanes and nine oxygens make six carbon dioxides and six waters. Cool. Obviously, if you're gonna use those numbers, you cross those out or erase them for yourself. There's your balanced, complete combustion of cyclopropane. You're welcome. Best of luck.